you were so handsome. Good morning, guys. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 18. I'm literally insane. This Vlogmas has gone by so fast. I just put on my new Lauren Elizabeth collection, and I just want to say the quality is absolutely incredible, like, and just so comfortable. They're actually flattering. They actually suck you in. I just this is literally I'm gonna live in this outfit. This is my morning outfit. I need to go edit. I'm gonna take the dogs out. Hi, bud. Hi, bud. Oh, oh my gosh. How does it feel to be the most handsome man in the whole world? Look at them. But they're little Santa bandanas, guys. So cute. Oh. All right, guys. This might be kind of weird to do. But I'm going to try new verse products. I know I'm in my kitchen. It's fine. Any day now. Okay. Oh, I'm going to feed you guys in like two seconds. They're so dramatic. They just had treats. Here we have the Verse Vacation Eyes Brightening Eye Gel. Maybe I'll get my nails done today. Honestly, I really should. Ooh, this feels nice. I don't have like really bad under eyes, but oh, love a good eye gel. Should I be using an eye gel every night anyways though? And we have this Dew Point Moisturizing Gel Cream. Amazing. Oh, wow. Wow. This feels really good. See, I just want something that's like crazy moisturizing and this, this is it. <gasps> Oh my gosh, guys. And I already did my skincare, but like this, wow. Okay, I really, really like this. And Versed is pretty inexpensive, I'm pretty sure. The Dew Point Moisturizing Gel Cream, 10 out of 10. I mean, what a beautiful looking couple. A beautiful looking Christmas card. A beautiful note. Ah, I just love Megan and Finley. I miss them so much. Look at them living their best lives. 4D, something like that. I don't know, it's effortless, and it's so easy to lay. I'm going down high, you know, move down the side of really good. Hi guys, I'm still editing, but I just want to say right now, if you still don't know what to ask for for Christmas and your parents keep like asking and, and like your parents just keep begging you to tell them, I have a great idea, okay? Because this is me this morning. And I feel like I don't really need things, but they were just like, please. And, uh, you know, they were they were over me, I think. At home gym equipment. Duh. I, you know, I'm making my den a better gym, but I'm asking for, like, the Bala ring. I got some, like, free weights. Um, like a P-ball thing. I just got a few things of equipment because Alyssa and I last night also decided that we're going to make my gym or my den like the gym of 2021. Everyone's going to come over at like 6.30 every morning and we're going to blast music and work out and it's going to be really fun. So I needed more equipment for that. So I will link below exactly what I'm asking for because I just made the list anyways. And it's just kind of like my at home gym thing. But I think that'll be really good. And honestly, it's going to be something I use like every single day. So <laughs> no fits. <laughs> dishwasher is so loud it is now noon i finished editing uploaded the vlog did a bunch of last minute christmas shopping helped my dad with some stuff i just went on my computer my stepbrother stepped by for a second and oh i also wrapped some more gifts both of these dogs are the cutest thing i've ever seen we've got some more gifts in about an hour i have my professional organizer coming back over we're gonna go through and declutter some spaces figure out what we want to order specifically and then go from there i'm so excited for my house to be so organized like you have no idea so i am going to order that stuff today after she comes over i will have her instagram linked below she's like the cutest person ever she's so nice she's available so hire her anyways i think i'm gonna take the next hour to just sit on the couch and watch vlogmas this is like the week before christmas where things are kind of slowing down besides deals and just not having podcast stuff and not having school stuff alone i feel like i have literally nothing to do it's nice though i'm excited to like kind of chill and have more of a slow paced last few weeks of the year comment below like when are you guys off for the holidays or like how much time do you take off i might take off like a week after christmas we will see best starbucks <laughs> drink ever
so unbelievable. Like it's literally horrible. It's so unorganized. It's because I can't see it. So when I get those things that glide out, it'll be easier. This is just a lot of backup product of like cleaning stuff too. And then this is just random. Okay, clean it out so that we're able, we're gonna be able to like organize it. It looks so much better. Oh my god. I can't wait till I have those things that pull like come out of my drawers or my cabinets. It's gonna be incredible. Oh my gosh. Where is it? What is it again? Wolfgang? Wolfgang, yeah, it's a rock wall. Oh, so cute. Well, the dogs are getting some cookies, so they leave me alone. Coco, you get fall la latte. Have a cup of cheer, because you're the perfect angel. Good boy. <laughs> and then the Texas one, which I'm like refusing to let them eat because it's so cute. All right, guys, it's 5 p.m. We have spent the past like three and a half, four hours going through everything in my house and getting ready. I just ordered everything that we need. So next time she comes, we're gonna go through and actually organize everything. She's just literally the best. I cannot recommend her enough. Incredible, also just fun to hang out with. But if you guys need um, to get anything organized and you live, but if you live in the Dallas area, check her out. She's so helpful and I'm like so excited. It's gonna be perfect for the new year. I'm gonna make my first mocktail. It's random. I don't actually have seltzer water. I only have sparkling water. Listen, I have more stuff and I will be making more this weekend. But I'm just gonna try my best and I'm gonna use my cocktail shaker um, solely because I just like, really wanna use it. Here's what I have. I have some ginger beer. I have some sparkling water and I have some lime juice. I don't have limes, so I also can't. Honestly, this will be like my weekend project. I might actually do this. So, ginger beer. Hopefully this is good because I'm really going for it here. I really need better glasses. That's like another thing that I need. Guys, also, I of course stained my shirt. Like, of course I did. Oh, wow. That was actually, oh, can you believe that? That was absolutely, that was perfect. Oh, it's actually really good. Like I see why it would be better with seltzer water, but this is actually really good. So it's the Trader Joe's ginger beer. I also got this at Trader Joe's sparkling water. It's the grapefruit kind. But I'm not gonna lie guys, this is really good. I just heated up some stuffed peppers from Trader Joe's. I'm gonna have my mocktail and watch some more Vlogmas. All right, I'm in my room. I am going to eat this chocolate bar and I'm going to finish The Undoing, which I am so excited for. So I just finished The Undoing. Here's the thing. I was expecting a bigger twist at the end. I'm not gonna give any spoilers, so if you haven't finished it, don't worry, but I know there's a lot of controversy on how it ends. I know there's a lot of controversy about how it ended. And I'm not going to go and say it was the worst ending ever. Like, I, I don't even feel like it was a bad ending. I just expected maybe a little bit more. But honestly, I'm fine with how it ended. I finished the show in three days. Yes, there were only six episodes, but that's really good for me. I just wanted to end today's vlog with just a little bit of a chat. And I kind of hate to even like say something because I know I feel like my vlog was this year hasn't been as like happy and whatever. And hi, how are you? Uh, he's so cute. Guys, he's actually going to be like 80 pounds. I cannot believe it. I was tricked. I was tricked. Yes, I was, but I love you. He's literally everything I could ever ask for. I love you, Fitz. Guys, just a little Fitz update. I know I talk about him in every single vlog, but I just wanna say, he is legitimately, he's legitimately the best dog that's ever, ever breathed, ever lived on this earth. So handsome too. Anyways, all that to say, I'm not trying to have my vlogmas be like super down this year. And honestly, I'm not even super down. I think I'm just dealing with a lot of like health and like hormonal issues. However, I will say after this year, it's just been such a weird year as everyone knows. And I feel like, so back to what I was saying, like Cheer came out on Netflix in February of this year. Like that's so bizarre. And I watched it in March. I'm like so confused. Anyways, I think that being 23 is a really weird age. Hey guys, I've been trying to record this clip. So this is me coming back, trying to regroup. But basically, um, I don't mean to be like negative or anything like that. I have a great life and I'm like so grateful for it. And I am genuinely happy. Um, however, I will say that I think 23 is a weird age. Sometimes the holidays are really weird. Can be really isolating, especially when you live by yourself and it's a pandemic and I don't know, like when the year just goes completely the opposite of how you expected it to go. I know so many of us are going through this. This is not a like, oh my gosh, life sucks type of moment. It's just like, I've just been feeling like a little bit down. I don't know if it's just because I'm like spending so much time alone 
or if it's just like the added stress of the holidays or honestly a combination of all of that but I just want to say like as much as I love Christmas so much holiday blues are a very very real thing and sometimes you just put a lot of pressure I don't know I think too just a combination of like so much change and life is just weird and whatever I don't know guys being said I'm sorry if I haven't been as like I don't know like maybe upbeat or I'm not trying to like sit down and be like oh my god life sucks like that's not even what I mean I have a great life and I'm really grateful and I'm like very happy with where I'm at and like who I'm with but I don't know I think it's normal to like feel weird sometimes especially at this age but it's just so maybe it's also like the uncertainty of what's gonna happen and not knowing what's gonna happen <sighs> so anyways i'm just going to actually probably watch a new show i'm getting into shows right now guys that is it i hope you guys enjoyed today's vlogmas i'm really excited to continue working with danielle and get the rest of my house organized it's gonna be so nice like i actually cannot wait but i love you guys so much and i will talk to you tomorrow